All right, guys. Let's continue. Um, let's take a look at the map. The map. Okay, we can go left, I mean right, if we want. And I've already been up to the library, which has a microfilm viewer. But we'll go to the right for now. Also, I hope the video quality is a little better than, well, ever before, because I realize I've been, I've been, uh importing my videos at 1080p when I'm recording uh, on 4k so hopefully if I import it as that it will look better on YouTube at least that's what I'm hoping I guess we'll see I assume it will but I'm I don't, I'm not I'm still kind of new to this whole YouTube thing, even though I've been doing it for like a year or two, maybe three years. I don't know how long I've been at this. No running in the hallways. Be mindful of your neighbors. Everyone can hear you run. Well, that's a creepy memo. There's a safe. Well, they said something about a safe being, um, the code being in the manual, right? Even though that's not what they wanted. So I'll have to find that, probably. Okay. Got three doors up here to try out can go up. That one's locked. Does it get marked as... Okay, it does get marked as locked, so I don't have to even touch it every time. Hello. An Elster unit? You should leave this place. This facility is lost. Turn back before it's too late. I'm looking for this woman. Have you seen her? Ooh. I don't know her. But she might be one of the workers. All Gestalt workers were sent to the mine below the facility. If she's still alive. She's probably down there. There is an access elevator to the mine shaft, one level below, but you'll need an administrator's key to use it. I see. I'll be out of here as soon as this repair patch stops my bleeding. You should get out of here too. I don't know who that woman is, but she's probably dead by now. If you still want to go, good luck. Alright. You're not a protector, so I can't tell you any more than I already have. They decommission us both. I'll be out of here. Okay. You're just going to go through your dialogue, I guess. You're just kind of repeating dialogue. Pick up protector key? Yeah. I will pick up protector key. Mm hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, I wanted to check out my inventory because. Um, the photo is different. Alina Seo can still be seen on an interesting. So that is definitely a different person than in the previous photograph. And this is obviously not the same 
photograph because it doesn't have the code on the back either. Interesting. But it's damaged in the same way, which is pretty weird. And that's for the observation room. It's probably the one up top. I guess that's the one we're gonna have to get into. Classroom key required, oh, maybe not. I bet it's that uh, yellow door. Did I see something move down below? Oh, I think it's just it's just my shadow. That's actually kind of cool. Okay, um, this way. This way. Use protector key. Cool. What do we have in here? A fan. A gun. Pick up pistol? Yeah. Picked up pistol. Pick up aperture card? Yeah. I can use that on the microfilm viewer. Type 75 pistol user manual. The Type 75 pistol is a short recoil operated locked breech semi automatic pistol chambered in 10 by 20 uh, millimeters. This reliable, versatile handgun is the standard issue sidearm for Aeon Protector Controller Staff. Replica users, remember to first equip the Type 75 pistol in the inventory screen to designate the pistol as your primary weapon for the targeting module. To deploy the weapon, hold left trigger to disengage the safety and enter targeting mode. While in targeting mode, RT and A will both fire the weapon. RB will initiate a reload. Alright, so it will not um, fire if you're not aiming. Remember, do not waste ammunition, for it is a resource of the nation. When a target is down, try to finish it off by kicking or hitting it with a baton to preserve ammunition. Okay. Memorandum Terminology I announce the following by order of Aeon. Due to recent events, in accordance with the new Aeon Public Interest Media Regulation, AGM 87, the term blank, which is currently in use in various Aeon facilities, is no longer permissible and must no longer be used. Premises uh, and departments that are currently using the term are to be immediately renamed. Interesting. So there's a term um, that uh, got banned. What is it, like some sort of slur or something? <laughs> I don't know. Or is it just uh, something else? Management personnel shall black out the term for from all s signage and documents until replacement terminology is announced by Ann. With immediate effect, usage of the term in conversation and correspondence is an offense obscenity to the state to be punished with two cycles of double work shifts. Yikes. It may not be easy, but we all have to do our part here. Always remember, our language shapes our world. A perfect world requires a perfect language. Adler. Um. Interesting. Terminals locked requires a password. Interesting. I can see an empty classroom on the other side of the window. The glass seems like it's tinted or a one way mirror. Yeah, seems like it. I, uh, I'm still trying to piece together what sort of nation um, 
this is? Is it like some sort of like dystopian totalitarian thing? Or is it not that bad? Because <laughs> then they're talking about how they're, you know, fighting with the remnants of the empire. It makes you wonder, were the empire the good guys or are we the good guys? I don't know. Anyway. Guess it's not important right now. Uh, I need to go to the. Where was it? The library, so straight up from here. Oh wait, I forgot to equip my thing. Give me a second. Boop, equip. There we go. And I do have uh, six slots. Indeed. I'm going to save it before going back out there. Now, is there any reason to fight this thing? As long as it doesn't get in the way, it should be a problem. Because don't they come back? From what I remember, they kind of come back. What did you even want? Why was she banded here? That's a good question. I think I already looked at that. Well, hello. Oh, hello. Are you a you're a Gestalt officer? You don't belong here either, do you? I'm Isa. Isa Itao. I'm gonna butcher some of these names. You should be careful. There's something wrong with this place. Yeah, I noticed. I don't know what happened, but it's probably dangerous to go any further. Da da da. That's okay, I understand. I have something I need to do to him. Take care. I hope you find who you're looking for. What were you doing with that knife? Were you chopping this body to bits or something? Did you kill it? Hey, look at this. Oh, I did. I think I looked at all of this. Oh, she left a note. Erica, if you find this note, despite everything that's happened, I've come to look for you. Isa. Hmm. Interesting. They, uh, despite everything that's happened, did Erica and her have a problem? Use the card. <clears throat> High security wall safe. Oh, it's the manual. This wall safe complies with USAN public safety equipment regulations 41 and 43 and features a high density craft style door secured with a numeric keypad proudly produced on HiMet by VEB Monden Tokter Tresor Technic. Instruction for use. Enter the code using the keypad. Press the confirm key in the lower right corner. If correct, the green light will light up. Rotate the dial on the left to open the door. Clearly previous under it, press the E key in the lower left. First time setup. Enter the factory default code 204512 to open the safe. While the door is open, enter the desired new code in the keypad. Press and hold the confirm key for 10 seconds until the green light lights up. Well, we can assume that it's already set to the default code because it would keep uh, reverting back to that or something. So we'll do 204512. <clears throat> I'm going to 
need to go down to the right, though. If I can kind of get past this... I'm not gonna use my ammo until it's uh, necessary. I know better than to do that. I don't need to save yet. I'm feeling brave. I think I... Yeah, that, that was the um, safe note thing. Uh, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Here. Uh, what was it? Two, was it 204? Oh my god. I didn't mean to... Two, four, five, one, two. Boop. Wait, no, it would have to be a. Uh, okay, let's try that again. Two, oh, four, five, one, two. There you go. My finger slipped once. What do we have in here? Pick up classroom key? Yeah. Picked up classroom key. Fantastic. Yeah, th uh, that's for the one way up top. Can I look at it? Magnet key for card for class from 4C. Um, Alright, I guess it's nothing too extraordinary. Well, there's a hole there. Probably gotta drop down that, don't I? What's this on the ground here? Pick up repair patch? Pick up repair patch. Picked up repair. I'm glad I caught that. And this. Great. Yeah, I would not have wanted to miss that. Well, uh, let's. There's a hole in the ground. It looks like I can drop down safely. Drop down the hole? Yes. Oh my god. There's, they're all glitchy and they're chopping stuff up. Locked. Locked. Okay, that's not locked. And this is, uh... Debris. Looks like... Block A7. We're on B2 now. Interesting. I've been saying interesting too much. I should stop. I need to think of more words to say. Okay, that's not locked. This isn't locked. Huh. Are these like, uh, oh, these are worker accommodations. I get it. Thought it was like a prison at first, but no. Well,. Maybe working here was kind of like a prison in a way. I don't think I ever got deeper than this floor when I first played the game, but I might be wrong. Diary. The protectors have been worried lately. They're hiding something. There's less of them. Ration plan keeps changing. Elena says I'm imagining and at them I can feel their fear like it's my own. What are they scared of? The protectors? Uh. I'm guessing the protectors are kind of 
built more for combat. I don't think we are. We're more of like a repair uh, replicant or replica. I think I'm getting mixed up with Blade Runner again. Is that what they were called in, in Blade Runner? Replicants? I swear that's what they were called. This has to be inspired by that somewhat. Service request form F29. Date of filing service request form 84216. Uh, Full protector ID of unit filing request. Star. Oh, we met Star early, uh, earlier. Um, status guard. Yeah, she's a guard. Worker quarters. Uh, uh, processing. Service object. Himmel type D automatic security door. Location of object. Worker block A6 corridor. Description the lock on the staff door in A6 is jammed again. Requesting a locksmith. Service status. Electronics reset key is nowhere to be found. I set up a lock picking kit, but management bumped the elevator engines up in priority. So next shift, well, I'll have to pick the lock. It's just trial and error at this point. Find me if you need a key to open the service hatch or ask management. Whatever. Funf. Funf. Is that how you pronounce it? Alright. Beep. Service hatch key required. I see. Du, 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 du. I forget, can we read previous logs? that we have um, read. Oh, I c we can. Yeah, that's nice. So what, did, what do we need to lockpick? Hmm. All right, I guess the door up top or something? I don't know. Need to find that lock picking kit probably. We don't want to be here though. What do we have to the left here? Stop staring at me cameras. Yeah, I didn't think that elevator would work. This one seems to. Will this take me back up? Hmm. Lang orbital Oberflash. Mininzugang. Vertical map of S23 Sir Pinsky. Uh, mine axis factory. Hmm. Oh, it's uh translating that. So we have the I guess the um, the workers up here. Um, the hospital wing below should be below us then. Then personnel, then protectors, then operational command. 
And I'm guessing mine access is probably way at the bottom there. Goes pretty deep then, huh? What do we have here? Pick up service hatch key? Oh yeah. I need that. I need a protector identification card to unlock the elevator control panel. I can't even go back up to the first floor? I guess not. I understand. this west wing key required that's locked okay it unlocks from the other side huh well, I guess all we can do now is uh, do the go to the service hatch. Yes. Use the key. Oh, is this the... Um, oh, this is the lockpick thing. Isn't it? An ultrasound uh, sensor mounted to the side of the lock. It's connected to the lockpicking device. Interesting. Oh, uh, all right. Well, I guess we'll have to figure this out. The door electronics reset switch. It normally requires a key to be operated. The screen shows the image from the connected ultrasound sensor. All right. I get it. Uh, what if I hit that? Okay. This re this is so um, oblivion right now. All right. Um, what are we trying to accomplish here? I guess as we're trying to line up, kind of where the notches are. Line them all up. I think that one needs to be up a little higher. Possibly. Can I go up a little higher? I can. Yeah, like that looks like what it's supposed to be. And that other one needs to be a little higher too. Like the same? No, that one needs even higher than the other one. Then do I just uh, r raise this one? Uh-huh. Alright, that wasn't... It's not too difficult when you know what to do. You kind of figure it out. It's locked. East wing key required. This is A mode. It's good to know. It looks like a butterfly case. The box is locked. It looks like it requires some sort of square shaped key. Alright. I understand. I'm not getting into the butterfly box today. Aha, another save point, and storage. 
Well, I do have a couple um, empty slots. Can I store the photograph? I don't see much use for it right now. But I'll keep the other three things. I'll take the repair patch as well. Oh, and those uh, stack, which is nice. Saved. Let's explore more of this floor here.